he's in green. Not the case. They really deked us. They deked us on that one. Going with the classic whites, which I appreciate, given the fact that Notre Dame's in all green with St. Patrick's Day weekend upon us. Face-off won by Michigan. First possession to the Wolver. Cohen and Baim is lethal. Lockwood sets a pick, comes off it. Now loose ball. This is where Notre Dame is so dangerous, picking up ground balls in the middle of the field, and Ben Ramsey picks up another one. Now he gets tripped up. No call. It's going to go back over to Michigan. Wow, no call. You see the fans hovering and surrounding this field. Notre Dame has done a terrific job in the community. Okay, as the events have been in cage 44. Lockwood runs into a defender, gets it up top. Shot. That looks like it hit the pipe. And we're going to get it inside the crease. Violation here. As really elevated Liam Entman in the clearing passes, defensive leadership, and making ground ball plays around the crease. Here's face on. Loses his footing, but gets it back. Back up to Dobson. We're going to get a delayed call here against Michigan. Kavanaugh wants to take advantage. He shoots wide. Let's get the call now from our officials. First flag of the day. It's his first big save of the day. If you play this group straight up, they're going to find the alleys, they're going to find the seams, and it's all slam dunks and layups. Taylor makes another save, goes out and gets it. Michigan loses it, though, another turnover. That's their fourth turnover of the game so far. Will this one come back to haunt him? It does. The Irish strike first. I believe that will be man up as Chris Cavanaugh, who's red hot of late, finds the back of the net. That was just as the clock was winding down on the penalty. The details will kill you in big games. Michigan with too many turnovers early. Irish driving chaos. Still 33 seconds to shoot for the Irish, so plenty of time. Pat Cavanaugh working on a shorty. He wants to take advantage of this matchup. Unfortunately, he lost his footing, though. Fell into the crease. He can't believe it. It's a turnover. Back to Cohen. Comes up field. Tiernan. 44. Stone by 44. Entman makes the save. Great approach on that shooter by Marco Napolitano. The assassin gets his hands on Tiernan. Man, a lot of turnovers back and forth in the middle of the field here today. Now we're going to get a flag. This is probably going to be a slash against Notre Dame. So Michigan will go man up. This game's got a pace that's a little herky-jerky, right? With the penalty, it'll be a fresh 60, and it's a tripping call, so it's one minute. Here's the call, Taylor. I mean, that, 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 Kevin Corrigan head Part of the slot as Lockwood steps in. That's Bame. Ronda. Aronson back up to Ronda. Nice catch. You see 44 just dancing in the front there. Now he gets it inside. Back outside. Bame, good ball movement. Score! Wow. Cohen finished it. That was tic-tac-toe and a thing of beauty by Michigan. They take a page from Notre Dame's extra man offense, and they execute... You talk about passing, count them. Into the hub man. Tiernan, normally the shooter, kicks it up top. Down low one more. Turn and rake. Squid offers. He, he is a passer. His eyes will be up. He can play midfield or attack. He's got to make something happen here instead. Oh, he does get in front. And Tiernan gets a shot off and scores. I thought Lockwood was going to dump it in the corner with just two seconds left on the shot clock cue. Instead, to your point, perfectly made. His head was up. He found 44 on the doorstep, and Michigan takes the lead. It's a little set play off the restart. Watch Tyrion. Loops. Fish hook. You cut the crease, you loop, and you cut it outside, and the fish hook gets a spot feed to space. Tyrion turns. Ball's in his pocket. It's a one. All-American. Here he is, eight and green, playing against a shorty. And he wants to get to his left with pace. Here's face on. He shoots and scores. 
Gio, we were talking all week long. The spotlight just grows in intensity on 14 in green with every passing week. The lacrosse world is abuzz with this MVP of the Sun Bowl as a wide receiver last year with five catches and a touchdown. Now he's scoring goals this spring. He's got unusual separation speed. Watch it, left to right split dodge. He plants with that left foot and boom. It's well and they're always looking fly on the, on the bench. Yep. That's gonna be too good of an opportunity. I mean, you're not gonna be able to give this kid, Pat Cavanaugh, that kind of room and expect to be able to stop that shot. Irish back on top. Week one, Michigan really struggled at Virginia in the pick game. And here it is. One of the fundamentals of playing the switch. Notre Dame back to Hagstrom. He loses it. Michigan fires it quickly with Bame. Right off the draw, Wheatfeld found Bame on the doorstep, and they get it right back. And the book on Wheatfeld is he likes to go out the front side. He's a senior now. Captain. Facing off. Bust and kill. This is that second slash third midfield unit for Notre Dame. It's Riley Gray, who's a big dude. Ten days rest. If you can get production from your second midfield, that is a big separator. Ronda looking to dodge off a pick. Passes it inside, try to get it to Tiernan, can't. Bo Lockwood gets it and shoots and scores! Are they going to call in the crease? They are. That's a shame. Lockwood with a fantastic goal disallowed. He had a foot in the crease. Just as the horn sounds to end the first quarters. And they may be I, a team that could challenge them down the road. They could. I, I think the Patriot League's wide open, quite honestly, after Army. I think Army sits atop the, the bunch, but who's going to be Patriot League too? Colgate beat Penn State. Could it be them? Could it be Navy? BU has a nice little history the last couple. Aronson comes off a pick. Get Conlon on him. Up top, see, here's Cohen with a shorty on him. Skip pass through. Ah, oh, it's a time to shoot. No panic. Good look. That time McLean got right on the doorstep. Kavanaugh saw him. Irish back in front. Starts with a pick. Watch how savvy McLean is off of this two-man action. He gets to X, sets a pick. Oop, slips it. Defense confused. Parks himself in front. Layup. McLean is ultra savvy. It has to do with the one-year graduate programs that they can offer. Cajal Roberts, Bo Pedersen coming over to Michigan with Christian Ronda. Bussinkill shoots and scores! Max Bussinkill is fourth of the year. The sophomore from Garnet Valley, PA, extends the Irish advantage. These goals are giant. These goals are culture builders. They're team builders. They improve your practice from Monday to Friday because you give a guy who hasn't been getting met very many runs a chance to run with the second midfield, and he produces. What does that tell the rest of the team? Uh, if I show up and have a great week, of, what's the temperature of the Kavanaugh brothers? He said hot and getting hotter. <laughs> <laughs> and I think it is in this game, too. Look at that shot on the run by Faye Samba. God. Part of the game. They just don't relax. They don't they don't give up any real estate for free. Much to the benefit of City Lax is oh boy, there's that lefty Dobson. You're seeing the formula for Irish success. Why they won a national championship, why in my eyes they are the prime contender with the Duke Blue Devils. The ride. Extra possession, defense suddenly tired. Dobson, he can win any matchup. Too big, too strong, gets to the middle. They had a little bit of a run there where they felt, where we felt like the ball movement was good. They weren't rushing shots. Need to take advantage of that again. That'll help. Oh, oh boy, Ensimen makes the save. 
This one he grabs almost. They're about in too. He said he totally changed his body type coming into this year. He's just in much better shape, physically more mature, much better out of the crease now in terms of setting up the clearing game. Good help defense that time. Dislodges the ball. Now it's loose in front. Picked up by Taylor. Taylor with just that one scoring opportunity early that he failed to convert on. Haven't heard much from him. Notre Dame defense is going to win out. Ronda gets it far side. Shot by Aronson. Deflected by Entman. Well, what else is new? 44 and Green seeing it really well. Here's Cohen. Trying to get an Aronson screen. Conlon slips it. Force pass inside, try to get it to Tiernan, and it's picked off. That's a beautiful play by Ben Ramsey. Here he comes. Good time to go. Up top. Dobson. Extra pass. Score! Wow. How do you not love that goal? That is brilliant lacrosse. I mean brilliant. Everybody doing their job, everybody playing with an unselfish attitude. It starts with the D. They collapse on the inside. Now here comes Ramsey. Watch him sniff this out. He's aggressive, but he's not out of control. Right here, he puts pressure on Ronda. They set a pick for him, nothing's going. He rolls back, draws a double, keeps it moving. Then you get one more down the side. Dobson, one more. Taylor does what he does best, slam. We'll donate $10 to City Lax. So they've got a great charity thing going. Our old friend Eamon Mack and Annie's charity, City Lax. I need to make a contribution. I stole a right down Charles Street line yesterday. I think I should make a $10 contribution right. every time I steal oh, an Eamon line. Beautiful lacrosse. Face on the recipient. All he had to do was dunk it home. Time out time for Michigan. 3-3 game has spiraled out of control. And th this is another wrinkle to Jordan's game. A cut. He's on the far post. The eyes of the defense are staring at the two-man game. Stepping up field to press Kavanaugh. Look at that. Look away feed right on the money. One touch. One that was really kind of frivolous. You could clearly see the foot was in the crease. And it is a six-minute scoring drop for Michigan where Notre Dame has scored five, make it six. It has become they take it, take it now for the Irish. They can sense it, huh? Pass down, pick down. Right handed. That's Chris, the younger of the Kavanaugh's. Two handed cradle through pressure. Strong, assertive. Shoots through that defender like he's not even. Win. They got a win against yeah. Ohio State, but you know, they need a big win. I, feel I like. like their offense. Their defense is ranked 61st in the country. Let's see if Michigan can take a punch. Tiernan can't solve Entman. Great quarter by Liam Entman, goaltender. He's made three amazing stops. The grad student, Chaminade, grew up in Massapequa. Got his start with the Massapequa. Here's Dobson. Runs by his short stick defender, loses his footing. And we got a loose ball in front. Dangerous here. His face on tried to pick it up, didn't have a good angle on it. Irish still keep it though. And now the defense is tightening up. They're getting more depth of scoring. Here's Pat trying to work through traffic in front. Far side with face on. To his left, shoots. On the L, he scores. Wow. He can't miss right now. Unbelievable. Coming back with his left like that, Q. Coming back with his left. Kids from Florida played slot receiver for the football team this year. He's recruited as a lacrosse athlete. But he wants to play both. He will continue to play both. He's going to be talked about on the, on the football field as, as a draftable pro prospect when this is all said and done. He's got us. Michigan being out of timeouts really cost him. See if Mikey Bame and company can get something going here. That's a start, but can't quite get it past Ensimit. 
Eneman's Ain't locked the look. door. He has thrown away the key. Good ride by the Wolverines, though. Bain gets it back, but is he going to be guilty of an infraction here? It looks like it's going to be a loose ball. Nick Harris, yeah, got. Irish up seven. That's going to be an illegal pick. Moving pick against 10 in green, Will Angrick. Again, Michigan struggling with the board. Scoreless here in this second quarter where Entman's made four saves. Lockwood working on light. Help comes that leaves turning open and he scores. That is something special from Bo Lockwood. Behind the net, little finalizer. Ryan Powell style. Get to X, change directions, whoop, come back underneath, little swim move, defense doubles, there's no rotation. Tiernan, slam it home. What a great pass. He got hammered here. Oh, no, the, the, the dodge and oh. then the pass, and this is where Tiernan's gonna make a living. Look at him. Maybe a little bit of belief in the locker room that they can make a second half run. Cohen swims. Still can't get away from Bergmaster. Rotten with a nice catch. And tried to get the shot off with his left. Couldn't do it. Instead, he went into the crease. Well, the thing that stands out to me is that each guy is starring in their role. So nobody is trying to be the superstar. They're just letting the game come to them and performing. Lynch and Wheat felt back at it to start this second half. And we have something we don't see very often anymore yeah. in the cross, a stalemate won by the Irish. An extended. Pat Cavanaugh, a stutter step, another one. You know, that play I didn't look like much. Angry. Yeah, he sees that Dobson is in distress and kind of giddy up and helps him out by being there first to the loose ball. Taylor, he's got a defender hung up. Back over to the wing. Got a feet inside, and they do, and Taylor, he wasn't going to miss that time. Extended possession, starts with a wing dodge. Taylor kicks it out to the wing, all sorts of space. Look, he got the whole side to work with. Defense flashes, they double team. They start ball watching. Look at all the Michigan white jerseys flowing towards the ball. Taylor's parked in the back. This team's committed to playing hard. You know, it's interesting, after covering that game last night, there's so much emphasis. You see, Cotter coaches like that take. That's a good look. See how Notre Dame splits. Keep you on the perimeter and they protect the middle. Lockwood feigns like he's gonna take a pick. He gets open now. An over the head pass, flick to Cohen. Ends up going the other way with light. Kavanaugh. Big problem here. Inside, Taylor scores. Nice job by defender Sean Light here. You want to be sticky on the inside and slide ready. Turnover becomes an offensive opportunity. Light knows his role, so he gives it up, but he continues to step down the field and be a threat. Defense has got to respect. I'm not sure why you leave Jake Taylor open. In Taylor gobbles that shot up from Kavanaugh. Good, Good stop. Kavanaugh just harassing him. Good hands by Taylor. Sophomore from Landon and Deason Ramsey. And how could you not? All-American short stick D mini. This is a big opportunity for Michigan. Tiernan absorbs the contact. Good ball movement. Hensman, best penalty killer is oftentimes your goaltender. Makes it look easy. Let me tell you, it's not. Turn and ready. Look at it. When Cohen catches that ball. Oh, now he's got the shorty on him. Surveys the field and will look to attack. Pass inside and Taylor again. Chris Wojcik's got this offense. Yeah, he's got this offense humming. First half, it felt like it was more perimeter stuff. 
Second half, they're just pounding it inside. Taylor's got three consecutive goals. Matchup issue, Kavanaugh against the Shorty. They know Michigan's gonna send the double team. Taylor follows the slide. He steps down into the vacant area. Follow the slide. Kavanaugh. Inside, spin move, face on, couldn't keep possession. It's good passing Thompson. by Notre Dame. Picks up the ground ball, over the shoulder shot, no angle. Taylor comes out of there with it, he's in a little trouble here, Ooh. runs out of it. Now the ball's on the ground, shovel pass and a score by Taylor. Taya, that offensive possession, maybe they got a little greedy, they eventually you know, jam the ball inside to Faison, who's covered pretty well, but they are, it's one cradle and a pass. And this, this is almost a carbon copy of Logan McNaney last week against Maryland, excuse me, two weeks ago. If you're a goalie, you come out and you misplay or make a momentary mistake. Hoping to go back this year when the PLL is out west. Right, you and me both, we were out there for the World Championships last summer. Gorgeous. 32nd man up from Michigan, and Bo Lockwood. Ronda. Pipes it home. You see Entman barking at a teammate defensively. He's not happy with the lack of rotation here. We talked about Ronda in the open. Grad transfer from Princeton. Had a little injury issue at the end of 2023, that broken collarbone, but man, he was a steady producer for the Tiger. Here's Angrich, spin, scores! He flashed as a freshman, sidetracked as a sophomore with that injury, but it starts with the steal. Again, we're just, Notre Dame is committed to ch making this a, a, every exchange they challenge, whether it's a ground ball, a pass, on, on a pizza flipper, and, 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 and gooses it to an attackman. You see his evolution today, the way he carried into the offensive zone with confidence. These, these young guys, man, they can improve dramatically. Freshman of Scotch Plains, New Jersey, Coach Wellner. To, oh, bounces in. That was a feed that to Taylor. Some English in it. This is a little spot feed to Taylor. Watch this. You talk about trust and a relationship, and I believe that's the fifth consecutive goal from Jake Taylor. Watch this feed, Cotter. This is just this is eye-to-eye -eye contact between two teammates. Low catch and finish. Again, everything's done right-handed. Who needs a left hand? Kark didn't have one. Jake Taylor doesn't either. <laughs> Conlon may have gotten a little bit of a trail check there, 20 and green. Wolverines have got to be asking themselves, what do we need to do here? Aronson, oh, denied! Had a right on the doorstep. I thought she could have just dunked that in without any of the fakes. The more fakes you can force an offensive player to make, the time is on your side, okay? Order. Game that was tied at three apiece after one has been dominated by Notre Dame since. Pat over the shoulder, then behind the back by Taylor. Well, now they're just showing off, Q. Sports Center top 10 plays. BTB squared. Wheatfelt wins the draw. And White again in the passing lane. Disruptive. Ooh, big hit. Oh, still loose. The 10, you better strap it up every single weekend because you're going to have a battle on your hands. Bain. 
Pass finished by Justin Tiernan. That's that a right bread there has and butter. Been the most effective offense. Yeah. yeah, that's exactly. That's the bread and butter. That's going to be the bread and butter. You know, Lockwood and Bain and Cohen are the initiators. Or Ronda. So they got four decent initiators. Tiernan is such a great player inside. I mean, in this game, he's had to take a back seat to Taylor. But you know, Tiernan could be. When it's all said and done, he could lead the country in goals this year. Big target lead. The Dobson. Pat Cavanaugh against Jack Whitney, best defender for Michigan. Tries a little twister. Lock with good pass. Bounce shot. Looks like that is, is that a far a kick post. Save? Kick save or post? That was an unbelievable stop. I think this might be a kick save, Cotter. No formal ceremony. Coach Coach Corrigan bypassed that. He just hung it up. Right. Yeah, right during the week. Like one day there it was you just go. hanging Hunter there. Taylor, big save. Like one day it was just hanging there. Release as I have ever seen. It reminds me of like Freddie Couples hitting a golf ball. It's just silky smooth, so efficient. Oh, that's a really nice twister right there. Aiden Mulholland. Power roll Here, dodge. Bit of that goal. Yeah, big power roll dodge. Watch how he uses his body here, his shoulders and his hips. And watch how he leans in and creates contact right there, spins, and finds net. Good body lean as he presses up, plants with the with the feet and turns to the inside. And he shoots that right out of the dodge. There's no hesitation. Patterson still out there on the offensive end. Sets a pick. Wow, on the run, Ronda. This we stand around, the ball kills when it's 30 degrees out. It just, yeah. it, it feels it feels like someone's throwing grenades at your knees and your legs. And as the weather gets nicer, you, I've always felt that goalie performances get better. Your hand, your, your eyes get more in tune with your hands, the repetitions. Well, this Irish offense is in tune. Pat Cavanaugh scores another one. The ball movement is just exquisite. Passing, premier, precise, completely unselfish. Multiple pass goals. Double team drawn, kicks it to the wing. Defense has got to rotate. There's a soft spot, a vacancy in their zone. Recovery, they're just tacked. There's a Bain gets a step on his defender, pass it inside of Tiernan. That is, again, it's patented almost. I mean, that is what Michigan does. And they once again do it well, and Tiernan ends up with another goal. That's four for him on the day. He's got that uh, Skywalker single eye face pain as well. Anakin Skywalker. Tiernan's really good at what he does. We've been treated to seeing two of the best crease men in the country. They know their role. Push in the back, not called. Michigan ends up with a turnover. And we'll Roberts. see. You know, still a ton of time in the season. It's it's middle of March. Yeah. Like they haven't really even started league play. Tier no, it's all about. Shot it, off. It, it continues to be all about improvement. Army, Denver, and Johns Hopkins returned a vast majority of their production. That's fine. It's what you do with those losses. So plenty of time for the Irish. Will Angrick in 10. Inside scores. Fisher Finley. From Alpharetta, Georgia. Yeah. Big Fisher. He's a make no more of an Irish name than Fisher Finley on Notre Dame. Look at him. Above mere Wolverines. Six Max Maniac, by the way. Oh, 
And the horn sounds to end this game, Q. What a dominant performance by Notre Dame. This game was 3-3 after one. Michigan was here for the fight on the road, but the Irish turned it on in the second half and never looked back. Very, very impressive. This, this was something else. The 